out here. Yeah, exactly. I'm not making no apologies for anything anymore. It so, is what it is. you're pretty much, you do everything. Absolutely. Let the people know what exactly is that you do because, I mean, I personally know you, but yeah. when it comes to acting, modeling, yeah. Music, yeah. I mean everything. Yeah, um, put you in some fashion. You might can model a little bit. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I've, I've been blessed. Okay. I've been blessed. So no, make no apologies. When did you When did you release that? Uh, uh, when did I released that. It's my mom. Man. My mom always calling at the wrong time. <laughs> She's trying to make sure you are yeah, right yeah, these streets. Um, about a couple of months ago, maybe like uh, three months ago, I think. So like where's the inspiration behind the song came from? Just, just you want to place your life now? Yeah, it. just, just going in, just doing what I do. Make no apologies. And why yeah. is that? What's? I mean, you don't supposed to live like with no regrets anyway. You know? Right. Think about it. Like, if you apologize to somebody, at the, well, the whole basis of the song with the uh, lyrics is that I apologize, but at that time when I said it, I meant it. So there was no need for me to apologize in the first place. Mm -hmm. So that was the whole basis of the song, and just going in, showing that. I'm well grounded, not somebody that's just, oh, he models, oh, he's an author, he's an actor, he's trying to rap. Nah, I can do it all. Because I actually started music first. Yeah, music was your first yeah, love. Yeah, that's right. how I got down here. Right. You know what I'm saying? So let's talk about what you've been doing since we've last seen you. Because, oh, like, life. your globe has been crazy. <laughs> we've seen you everywhere in Atlanta. Not even just Atlanta, like, you've been just moving, shaking. You've been on a big screen. We, yeah. I've seen you in short films, all kind of films. Magazine What's going on? Like, what you been up to? Uh, being blessed. Being blessed. <laughs> <laughs> nah, um, I got uh, let's see what I got. Let's see what I got going on. I got um, uh, I got. I hate when people do this. I got um, one movie. I got a um, movie coming out, short film coming out called um, Leave. Mm -hmm. Um, that's um, that's with uh, Focus Films. Mm -hmm. I got that going on. Um, that's coming out like probably around October. Um, I got a. Uh, and what's your character in that? Um, I play this. Uh, it's four, four, uh, four couples. Well, two couples. Mm -hmm. I've been in the cabin. Um, and it's so like a modern day. What's the Tyler Perry film? Yeah. Why did I get married? You know, no, like a horror with Lee. Yeah, oh, it's, it's a horror. Like, yeah, like, it's, it's actually. And and yeah, yeah, yeah oh. I got, it's a horror movie. Like we go to a cabin and I can't really oh, tell. Oh, so people start dying. Yeah, yeah people. Like, you die first. No, no, absolutely not. I'm about to say, he I'm like, like, you, I'm Jordan, you like you just give me this, nah, I die first. Nah, <laughs> and, yo, I promise you, if they would have said me, I got to die first, I'm not even going to take the part. Really? <laughs> <laughs> so I'm doing, I'm doing Leave. That's coming out in um, October. Um, what else? Of course, I got that. The Traceless and One Man's Trash. I've been doing that. That's coming to a big screen. Uh, I'm working, I'm actually working with um, Sigma 23. Uh, with Mocha with uh, Shamia Morton. Okay, that's coming out in September. I saw I I I I saw when they were previously filming that. I didn't know that you were part of that. Oh, I'm the star. I'm mean, one of the stars. She's the star. I'm the second. Okay, so seven two three. That's a whole different fan base. Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm 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 built for it. Okay, you know I'm built for it. Okay, you know I'm built for all that. Um, I've been getting harassed anyway, so it doesn't <laughs> matter. <laughs> so I've been getting harassed anyway, but it's cool. It just shows that. I'm not afraid, and you accept people for who you are as long as they accept me for the craft that I'm bringing mm -hmm. and everything else. So that's all it's about. And then I got another one I'm actually working with them. It's called Jackson Stone. Like, it's it's vicious, bro. Mm -hmm. But they're going to love it. Yeah. Oh, they're going oh, they to love it. But it's vicious. Uh -huh. Like, it's called Jackson Stone's uh, Death uh, Wish. I'm just, I'm a schizophrenic. It's a whole other, it's a whole different me. Well, I like the fact that you're not boxed in, like nah. even with working with a production as such, or you know, just long as I've known you, period. You've never, when it comes to to that. Okay, for the people who don't know what I'm saying that are listening, uh, Sydney 23 is a pretty much catered to a LGBT, LGBT community. Yeah. So I was asking him, like, is he ready for you know, not necessarily backlash, but people having questions and all this other kind of stuff. But what I like is remain an actor. Yeah, and I people mean, know, like, you know, this is this is a job this, and this, this is, is a role, and keep it moving. This Atlanta, <laughs> hello. They gonna question you no matter Period. what you do. Yeah. I mean, I come on. You see, you can be seen with my lady 100, percent but they still gonna say something. Right. But I don't care about that. Like, yeah, and the thing about it is that 
are you acting or you know are you pretending? If you're really taking the crap seriously, you can jump into any character. Yeah. And most of the people that go, oh, I can't believe you do that. They're not people that's come on. You already and know. The main people that's not booked. Yeah, and asking yeah. you how I get in the movie, how I do this, how I do yeah. that. Yeah. Um, because I'm taking roles. You know the odd, <laughs> the odd thing about that is most of the actors who are are from those roles. Arts. Yeah. And. Yeah, I think because you know the, the guy who plays in Tyler Perry's um, Have and Have Not, the black guy, um, Jeffrey. Yes, not at all. Like in real, nah, life. you see, wouldn't even think. Like I'll be like, okay, but it it, it gotta be dope. Yeah, like, yeah. I can't play like you, you know anything random. Is uh, it, it, okay, like, if I take that point, I can't take like you know you know the flamboyant. Like I can't mm -hmm. do that. That's, mm -hmm. I'm just too manly. Like, mm -hmm. but if, if it got something, but see. I'm killing. Mm -hmm. I'm destroying people. Oh, he was the last time he was hearing me with Kevin Glenn. Yeah. What movie yeah. was that? Uh, man, that shit got. Damn, oh, man. Man. I know you mean. Uh, it was that, yeah, that got like over 3 million views. Yeah. What, what, what was his name? It's called Redskin. 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 I, I watched that. Yeah, that was the last time you came up here. I remember and you that. See, and you see how crazy that was on that? Oh, yeah, that was good. So it has you watched to, that? Oh, he was psychotic. Yeah, you I was. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I think she liked it that part. I'd have been like, this boy is crazy. Nah, but see, the thing about it is that. It's a different role mm -hmm. for me. Yeah. So people didn't see me as Karis, they see me as Santana. Mm -hmm. So when you see me as this person, you're gonna see me as Jackson Stone. Mm -hmm. You're not gonna see me as, okay, this person. Cause when, cause you know me, when you see me, oh, look at my guy, he's cool, such and yeah. such and such. Yeah. By myself in the cuts and such. But when you see this character, yo, think about it. Mm -hmm. Everybody was saying to Santana, mm -hmm. oh, he's the devil. Yeah. yeah. He's this, he's that. And mm -hmm. I'll be honest with you, I enjoyed every bit of it. That means that whatever I brought to that character. I don't know why I, I can just thing. see you body in that role. Like, you yeah. just, I think you <laughs> like turning into the evil person. Yeah, I'm proud of you, I do, yo. So, I'm have you been enjoying acting? Uh, because, you, like you said, you are a jack of all trades, but uh, you, you do so well when you do act. Yeah, um, acting is, is, honestly, come on, you think about it. Everybody, everybody's modeling. Yeah, it, you, know, you know me. I did it for real. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> right. So, yeah. That's what I was like. So now you got everybody that just uh, shout out to everybody that do it, but the craft they doing it wrong. So mm -hmm. it's like, I right, you gotta you nice looking. Somebody said, oh, you nice looking. You do this, and then they do it. So, but you can't you can't good look or uh, acting role. Yeah. You can be good looking, but you can't good look or acting. But you gonna be good like, or Ooh, bad. He fine, but he is sorry. Yeah. <laughs> so. So when it comes down to acting, like he sucks. I, I've, been, I've been doing theater since I was a kid. So when it comes down to acting, I, I'm like acting and music because I write my own stuff. Yeah. So wait, I'm going to the music part. Okay, well, with acting, even, okay, my book, my, I wrote both of my books, Modern Maniac and My Beautiful. Let everybody like, know where they can find your book. Uh, you can get it. Uh, just go to my website, uh, CarisJordanInc.net. How long ago was that? The book. Which one? Um. 2012 was Modern Maniac, um, and uh, a year ago was uh, My Beautiful Ugly Life. I actually had a book release and sold out all my books, man. And I had somebody fly from another state just to come on, that's love. Just come meet and greet. Yeah, that's All love. right, lit. Well, I want to hear more about it. So we just talked about his acting and stuff like that. We're about yeah. to slide into one of his singles, and when we come back, we're going to get into more music with Karaz Jordan. Y'all keep it locked. Karaz, man. You always Karis. say that. Karaz. 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 Y'all keep it locked. Because WTNT 107.7, <laughs> Q in the streets. Yeah. Y'all always say Karaz. I know. Yeah. Yeah. You still pushing your book? I, well, I mean, it's, it's always there. You still push it just, just to have yeah, it's always there, yeah. It's always there. Um, I don't like if I do like a spoken word or something like that, I say something about the book or something like that. But with your book, you never that's forever, you know what I'm saying? Your book is forever, so you keep pushing it. Um, so who you, who, who you, who you, who you, who you, uh, who you think you sound like? Uh, yeah, Karis Jordan. But like my music, like I think with my voice, the way my voice is, people was like, ah, oh, damn X. People were saying certain things. But the thing about it is that with my music, my voice changed. Like, listen to that one. This is the No Apologies. Everything is always different. And then yeah. you got the next one. Because this sounds, this, this, your voice sounds different. Sounds way different. I'm glad you got some massive music. Cause you know, I'm going to tell your ass. Oh, 